So for anybody out there in the world that doesn't know, you say hit up five times or Kenny Kenny G, you say got, you got shot five can, times. Let's just show that real quick. Show real quick. I got, he still got some shells in him. If if you want to let the to let the world know. I got a, a twenty two right here, you feel me? Three different guns, you hear me? And I got a three fifty seven magnum right here. I got another twenty two somewhere over here and somewhere over here. TMZ said this is for real. Like mm -hmm. don't I ain't, my, my name may become Kenny G for no reason. For no reason. So the incident that led to that, would you like to talk about that at all? Motherfuckers broke. That's all it really was, you feel me? I had, I just motherfuckers just had got their little last wolf from their job or whatever. I had to leave their ass, so I had to get my last job, my last, last check or whatever. I went to go grab me a pack. Motherfucker, some shorty, some shorty hit me up. She hit me up, talk about she, she needs some love. I'm like, yeah, she need a half. I'm like, they all in dubs, you feel me? She... Bag him up, I'm all right, bet. She hit me up talking about she was outside. I sent her address down the street somewhere. She, I'm walk outside, I look down the street, I'm texting her while I'm texting her, telling her she ain't out there. She like, I'm in a blue car. Some dudes walking down the street. They like, hey, bro, you got some weed? Um, mind you, my auntie house, the way it was, it's like 10 flights of stairs, and then you got to walk a little bit just to get to the door, oh, and then you got to walk up three more stairs to get to the oh, door. So I'm standing at the top of the tent, they walking up, they you got some weed on me, yeah. I walk in the crib, actually I jog in the crib, you feel me? I see them come sit on the steps right by the door as I'm weighing up they weed. I'm already thinking it's some weird shit. I took my weed, my money, put all that shit behind my auntie TV. As soon as I walked outside, closed the door a little bit, walked down the steps, they both up them. Dude with the 22 was behind the dude with the 357. Looking at both they dumbass, like what y'all mean? I ain't got shit on me but a point A. <laughs> I'm point eight, you feel me? So I'm thinking, I'm, these niggas gonna blow me anyway. They ain't got no mask on, those rookie ass mistake. Right. So I smacked the first gun, the 357 Magnum. I smacked <laughs> that bitch. Instantly ran in the crib. As I was running in the crib, the dude behind him with the dudes, dudes, he got the blaming that motherfucker. Boom, 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 boom. And then the other dude must have came back up with that bitch. All I heard was a bah! And then I heard a ch ch. And I instantly got in the crib. I'm like, I think I'm hit, Auntie. She like, sit your ass down, huh? Take a step. I ain't know I was shot through my leg. I fall. As soon as I fall on my back, all I seen was bright lights. And that was her kitchen light that was up there. All I seen was that light. I couldn't even see, like, like, like what is it? The shadows of people, like, over there. Yeah. Silhouettes and shit. So I'm, damn, I'm talking to them. This is not real. I'm throwing up a whole bunch of blood and shit. They told me that the, there was no blood coming out my back until I got in the ambulance. And then once I got in the ambulance, the blood started coming out. That's when I fainted. I was, they said I passed away. They brought me back to life. I passed away for seven minutes. And that's crazy because seven is my favorite number, as you can see on my 2K player. That shit no crazy. <laughs> I was gone for seven minutes and they brought me back to life, whatever them things it's called. They brought me back. They got a heartbeat. And then that's when they got to going in on surgeries. I was in a coma for about two days. I woke up and everything was not real. I got to see my niggas. I got to see my mom. Yeah, I know, yeah, I know. This shit was not real, but I'm here. I was out the hospital seven, six days after that. Then I had to go back to the hospital two days after I was out because I was in the hospital. I was in a hotel with my mom because she from Vegas. She in Vegas. She took a flight down here as soon as she heard about it. We at the hotel, a whole bunch of fluid got in my lungs, and I woke up, couldn't breathe like that. I'm, <laughs> I'm fighting for my life down there. I'm in the hospital. I went to the hospital. Yeah, I'm in the waiting room for a whole hour. Damn, they're dying. They take me in. And then once they take me in and see that I have all that fluid in my lungs, then that's when they want to get me in the emergency room. All this other extra shit. But I went through four surgeries throughout the whole time. They want me to go through more to try to get these motherfuckers out. But shit, I'm still doing what I'm doing, so I'm not worried about it. They ain't hurting me. So they ain't going nowhere. They gonna be in me until they come out. They damn self. Right. I, don't got, I ain't got time to be crippled on mold like that shit. Dead. I went through that. Man, I'm. Yeah. Man, yeah. Shout out for my nigga J down. He just got hit up two times. Damn, they're the same shit as me, bro. Got his ass stapled up and some more. Shout out my nigga, man. Shout out, bro. You doing this thing? Very lucky to be here. The situation has something to do with like a female on some bogus shit. Yeah, but it wasn't even the female. It was. It was the dude. Oh, it was her boyfriend. He was on her page because I guess he got blocked off his page or something. Oh, it was that bitch. And, and, was, it was jeal jealousy, basically. <coughs> some, you, know, you say you're only 20? I'm 21. 21. How old were you when this happened? I was 19. 
Very young. Were you bigger at the time? Man, see, that's why, I, that's why in my, oh my God, I said, uh. He was buff as hell. Still buff as hell. Bro, <laughs> I, I about forgot about what that. I said in this shit, but I said, man. I got hit up five times, but ain't going. I got hit up five times, but ain't going. Remember, posted on, remember, blocks, posted on blocks, I was swollen. Mm -hmm. Put a fear into all of these hoes, man. I'm not playing. That's when, facts. when it came to Mouse You, motherfuckers knew how I was coming. If they did, they was getting their ass beat the fuck up. Man, and that's how I'm coming. I remember he just walk up and beat people up for no reason, like. <laughs> I don't know. Punch your motherfuckers, man. Then they can slide the edges. But I mean, just cause I'm just cause I'm a little bit smaller don't mean that these bitches still ain't coming. They actually ten times faster and they hurt more. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>